This is the second episode of Shadows of the Rose playthrough and the challenge one death equals one push up. In the last episode, I didn't even do the warm up push up and I didn't die because it was the beginning of the game. So today we are starting with the warm up push ups, which will be five of them, and then we will carry on with the game. Let's do this. Hey guys, we did our warm up. I hope you did it too. I encourage you to join me in this challenge. Let's get back to the game. So, as in the previous episode, we went, we met the Duke in Castle Dimitrescu, and we established that we need to find yet another masks. That means that we will be searching for them today. Okay, we can't go in here because we are missing an item here. And yeah, for each death I will be doing one push-up. If you didn't know, now you know. I encourage you to join me. Okay, so three eyes key, three... The, uh, the key with three eyes, apparently, yeah? We need to find... Okay, handgun ammo. Perfect, we needed that. And we need that key to get the shotgun. So once you, we will find it, I will show you the location of it. But for us for now, I don't even know where that's located. Ew, what the hell? It sounds like me when I need to smoke. God damn it. Go away, dude. It's like a pedophile. She's underage, you ugly motherfucker. Like, seriously. She's underage. She's just 16. Ew. I don't get it. Okay, bolt cutters. We have the item. Now we can go to the courtyard. Perfect. But here have you noticed this idea, like, she's underage and everyone's chasing her to do her butt things. It shouldn't be like this. Okay. Over here. Hi, Michael. How are you? Should help. If you really want to help, you could back me up against those things. I can't. What? So I'm on my own? Great. Welcome to the adulthood, child. <laughs> In the adult life, we are always on our own. We can only count on our friends. But not always, unfortunately. So yeah. Hey guys, let me know in the comments below how many of true friends do you have in your life? There's grouse lumpy thing growing here. I'm curious if I'm alone in here because I can count my good friends on the one hand's fingers. So, yeah. Am I alone here like this? Let me know. I'm curious. Okay, let's go. We found the first herb. Oh. Okay. Mask trapped. Break core. core. Dude, learn the Ooh. fucking grammar. It's you not so hard. Lumpy thing? How am I supposed to break it? Use your powers. My powers? I literally came here to get rid of them. But you have to use them to get rid of them. Logic, yeah? Yeah. Okay. Fine. But how? What am I supposed to do? Use the force. Need amplifier. What's that? Keep going through the door. I mean, it's a little bit weird. In this game, we are like totally led. Like someone was holding our hand and showing us where to go all time long. So, yeah, it's not bad, but it's not necessarily a good thing for me. Uh, because I like to hang around the place and search for all of the ways and things. And if someone's showing me where to go all the time, I feel like a little bit awkward. I don't know what you think about this, guys. Let me know in the comments below. Would you like the game to show you the way? Like it's showing it here? Or would you like to search 
for everything on your own? I'm curious. Let me know in the comments below. And if you're enjoying this video so far, please remember to hit the like button and subscribe to the channel. I hope it will spread to other people and more people will see how to solve all the things and join to our challenge. Thank you very much for doing that, I really appreciate it. Okay, I can use these things and combine them together, help plus chem fluid, gunpowder plus chem fluid. There might be more items I can combine, I need to do whatever I can to survive. Oh shit, Sherlock. It's like crafting 101, I suppose. Okay, it's locked from the other side, so that was the further way we should have known. Through. Okay, how much ammo do I have? 10 and 4. Can I craft something, actually? Okay, I've crafted some bullets. I might need those gunpowder. Remember guys that we are playing on hardcore mode, so I'm gonna be dying very very soon. Oh no, he's sucking out her soul. I didn't know like they have Dementors in Resident Evil, you know? They apparently have them, as you can see on your with your own eyes. Okay, we escaped that one. There is other one dropping from the ceiling. No, 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 no! Chem fluid. Okay, did we escape them? Oh, yes, we escaped them. Nice. They didn't kill me. Oofed. Oh, oh no, no! No, 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 no! Don't tell me there's more of them! Oh, I thought they are coming out of the floor, if you know what I mean. Ew. Place makes my... I feel itching on every part of my body when I feel... When I see that gross thing on the floor. Ew. Ew, ew, ew. Okay, we are... Going back to the rooftops, but with the different character this time. Okay, we are upstairs, finally. Finally upstairs. Let's see what we will find in here. More disgusting things here. Uh, nothing here. Nothing here. Maybe we'll find sniper rifle, like in the Resident Evil Village, like in the main game. No, oh, it's just a draw. I have found a means of chromatically destabilizing parts of the mutimized network by introducing a disruptive force to block the outer indices they use for communication. For example, the hard packed cores of mold known as sclerotia begin to break down cellular level and disintegrate when thus disrupted. Sclerotia form when the mutimized develops in new locations, serving as a sort of anchor point or foothold. They are often associated with a patch of liquid void through which the mold has spread. When the outer inducers of the sclerotia are disrupted, it begins to break down. Any liquid void connected to the sclerotia will also disintegrate. It would appear that stabilizing the sclerotia sends a signal indicating that location is no longer viable for mutamized habitation, triggering a full-scale retreat. Good. Good. Herb, cam fluid. Where was that goddamn cam fluid? I've seen it, but I didn't take it. Okay, RW variant flask. What is this? So, what am I supposed to do with this thing? Focus, focus. this thing. Yes, focus this thing. All right. See? Ah, oh, no, she's using force on it. Different somehow. Yeah, so let's see if this works. The logic of the game so far. We are coming here to get rid of her forces 
in the mold and all and but she somehow is getting more and more power see f logic seriously like seriously f logic she came here to get rid of the powers they are getting stronger and that was a good example of her forces getting stronger God damn it. So it's for now, game is completely going to different direction thus than anticipated. But yeah, who am I here to judge? You know guys, it's weird, but I believe it's on purpose because if we would get rid of the forces or her powers or, or whatever <gasps> Ouch, I would break my ankles here. Um, like, yeah, if we got here to get rid of the powers, and we got rid of them, like, in the first half an hour, that would be weird, right? There wouldn't be a reason for the story to exist on any level in this game. Knock, knock. Who's there? Me, I kill you! <laughs> kill us but he was close <laughs> so as for now we didn't do any push-ups apart from the warm-up today okay let's use the force rose I wanted to say use the force look but I've reminded myself I just recalled that we are not in the goddamn Star Wars we are in Resident Evil and she's not look she's rose yeah Okay, of this. No, for now I'm not crafting stuff unless it will become necessary. Give that guy an oxygen tank or something. He's clearly suffocating. Dead. Oh no! Oh ho ho! That goddamn mother <coughs> surprised me as f No! No! No more to run! Ah, leave me alone! No! He's sucking off my soul! God damn! Yeah, I've got the attachment and I didn't put it in. Ah, but first we have to heal. Ah, no shit, Captain Obvious. No! Go away! Okay, finally he's dead. Okay, let's put the attachment in. Okay, now we can have 16 bullets. We can craft an... Okay, I will use this um, med kit here. So for now, we are sorted. We'll see for how long, though. This game has weird frame rate drops from time to time, and I can't figure out why it's happening, but it is happening. And it's uncomfortable a little bit, but yeah, it is what it is, I suppose. Okay. Those bastards! Like, are you f serious right now? No, don't stop chasing me! No! Leave her alone, you f***ing perv! No! Leave me alone! Okay, so it's time for... Oh, so lovely. 
Okay guys, it's time for the first push-up of this episode, apart from the warm-up. Let's do this! Let's do it! Okay guys, so it's six push-ups so far today. And we will be doing with more of those, I suppose. Okay, where are we at? Oh no! Oh, we, we are here. Knock knock! Who's there? Ah, it's you, freaking pervert! <laughs> Pedo, die! <laughs> Fuck! Well, you know, it reminds me of like, if you're a girl and you're going to the club and there is a guy who's trying to kiss you, I think thou had how that's how you feel, right? Girls, let me know in the comments below. If that's how you feel when an ugly guy in the club tries to kiss you. <laughs> Is he sucking your soul out of your body? I'm curious. Let me know in the comments below. Okay, let's do this. Let's carry on. We've got a lot of bullets. Not so much. Not a lot, but enough to survive, I believe. I believe we can do it. Okay, I can see him from afar. Oh, one down. I heard another one. No! Why? He almost got me. No, 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 dude. Find another girl to kiss, you ugly one. Yeah, sounds like a story of my life, you know, when I was back in the clubs. <laughs> I'm just kidding, it wasn't that bad. But it could have been, it could have been, but it wasn't. At least not every time. Okay, let's forget about what I just said, let's forget about the details uh, because you don't have to know all of that <laughs> but if you have any weird funny stories from the clubs or from the parties feel free to share them in the comments below and I will be happy to respond to them with mine or if you would request me to tell you some stories from parties and clubs and places like that Please also leave a comment below, and I will be happy to share those stories with ya. I mean, not entirely happy, but that's what I'm gonna do if you request it. <laughs> Run! Run! Ah, no, f*** them! F*** them, just, just, let's go, let's leave this place, okay? <laughs> that's the best thing we could do. Oof. I have five bullets only. Five bullets. Can I open this door? No. Oh shit! I went back! God damn it! I'm so stupid! Okay, can I craft some ammo? Yes, at least I'll have more bullets. There are still. These guys are still here. Rose, don't be scared. I'm here with you. You're not alone. I take care of those perverts for you. No! Yeah. Okay, and I'm dead again. Yeah. Okay, number two. Okay, so we died twice by now. Oh. <coughs> so we died twice. We did seven push-ups in total, which is nice. That's the seven push-ups you wouldn't have done, or I wouldn't have done if I didn't die.
Okay, that one's dead. We have to save some ammo, we have to be more careful with ammo. Because uh, when I'm shooting it all, all away, I don't have enough to take care of the other dudes that are appearing there. Okay, so let's carry on. For ammo, perfect. Almost two clips, two full clips of the ammunition. If him, give me a break, get. This one's dead. Donald tries. Uh, he's trying to approach us again, but look how he bugged. Seriously, what the hell? Where is the f pathfinding? Like seriously, that was like a stupid bug that shouldn't have happened, you know what I mean? It changes the replayability of the game and the playability itself. Like, you know, it doesn't even feel real or scary when he's stuck like this. Change my mind in the comments below. Let's see. Let's see what you've got to tell. Okay. Oh, shit. It's here. Right. I've almost forgotten about this again. Okay. There's two of them. And I have 13 bullets. But I need to go to the distance. So they will not surprise me like in the previous attempt. And they killed me. Okay, one's down. There is the second one. Nasty <laughs> Edogonia! You know that song, like, by Tattoo? It was released, I don't know, in 2002? Originally in Russian. But later, I don't know in which year, it was also. Um, released in English. It's more like a pop music or something along those lines, you know? Uh, yeah. Okay, we killed them, finally. Okay, is this the way back? Yeah, no, yeah, no, no, yeah. <laughs> we are going in the right direction. I'm just so freaking stupid sometimes, you know? Yeah, so if you don't know that song, go check it out. It's nice music. It's, you know. In English, that means basically they're not gonna get us or something along those lines. I do not, I do not speak Russian fluently, so. What's happening in here? Okay, moldy thingy again. Moldy floors. Okay, let's get that one. Robert, no! Good. Gunpowder. Okay, let's search through this area. Okay, we can see where the second mask is located. Monocular door deep in the basement. But we ain't got no key. Okay, we need a key here. It's locked. Okay, so we can get our first mask in here. <laughs> okay, we have mask, bronze mask. Oh, I finally got it. This is just the first one, girl. Chill out. We still have two more to find. Don't get overexcited about it. I'm gonna lose my voice after recording this episode. Episodes, this game in general, because I'm gonna screw.
scream a lot more than previously. Yeah, and I scream a lot on the live streams as well. If you didn't know, now you know. Rest. Don't tell me how I'm supposed to live my life. Everything. None of this was supposed to happen. Uh, another frame rate drop. No. <coughs> here hasn't changed. I need that crystal. Thank you. Cheers, dude. So we've gotten first aid. We don't have the key in here again. So let's go here. Place the mask on the right place. Okay, so the bronze masks. Mask. Bronze mask is going to be down there. No, it's going to be another mask here. We need like Oh, this is where the bronze mask belongs. See? If that was helpful for you, remember to leave a like and subscribe to the channel. Thank you very much for watching today's episode and I will see you in the next one. Take care. See ya.